Well, now to a battle over the bill. Georgia Senator John Ossoff defending the next round of relief after Governor Brian Kemp says it's a blue state bailout. Our Danae Bucci joins us now live with all the back and forth. Danae. Well, Governor Brian Kemp says that this new bill would give $1.3 billion less dollars to the state of Georgia. But Senator John Ossoff tells me that those funds will just go directly to smaller cities and governments. What this is really about is local control. As the bill stands, the federal government will be able to give relief directly to local governments, something not possible in the last round. The CARES Act did not provide direct relief to localities, that is cities and counties with residents less than 500,000. It was all sent through the governor's office. We asked for an interview with the governor on the topic, but his office declined. Good afternoon, everyone. Instead, oh, yes. directing us to this op-ed published by Fox News. In it, he says red states are being punished by the federal government for not doing stricter lockdowns. Despite, according to the governor's office's calculations, Texas would be receiving the third largest allocation of funds. It wasn't but a few months ago that Governor Kemp was saying that he didn't want any federal support at all for the state of Georgia. But the governor's office says if relief is being given out, a fair amount should be given to the state. The governor would rather that he controlled all the purse strings so that he can determine who in Georgia benefits. And the senator's office tells me they do expect Georgia to receive nearly $8 million in funds altogether. Shannon, back to you. And we also understand Senator Ossoff says he's been working with Mayor Van Johnson to ensure Savannah gets a fair share at relief. Danae, thank you.